Hey guys and welcome back. Um, right, so last time we were collecting gravel and stuff. Uh, do you guys want me to do it off channel? In fact, to be fair, I probably will do Matt collect off channel in a bit as it's probably one of the most boring things to watch. But there you go. Um, we must be getting close to our gravel stack. We've got 37 gravel, so no, we're nowhere near. And I've let the water in again. Okay. So we've got some more gravel. There's some more gravel over here. Get this. Um, you may have noticed that my uh, sniffing has severely decre uh, decreased recently. Um, that will have something to do with the fact that over here it's been constantly raining every day. So in hindsight all the pollen is pretty much gone for now. Whether we get... Whether that's the end of our summer, being England, possibly, who knows, but we shall see. Um, but yeah, so hopefully there'll be a few episodes without my sniffing, but the likelihood is it will return, and for that I apologise in advance. Ugh. I need to get better tools. I can't keep doing this, this is just killing me. Nearly there. We have nearly there. Nearly there, guys. One more stack to go. So, yeah, how you all been? What you all been up to? Um, it's recently Father's Day. Um, my son brought me a new pair of slippers. And he made me a card, which was really nice. So, yeah. I hope you all had a good Father's Day out there. What are we on now? 31. We are getting there slowly, guys. Very slowly, but we're getting there. Let's not make the mistake we make every time. And, you know, dig through to the water and then cause ourselves hassle. If I'd suggest this will be that quest completed now. Oh, well, that was unexpected. What have we got here? Bauxite. Oh, let's get some bauxite. Not quite sure what bauxite is for. <coughs> I'm sure I'll find out. In fact, I'll check in a minute. Let's see. Um, 58. Let's just do this first. 9, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 63. 64. Nope, 63. There we go. Two stacks. That's that done. In fact, I believe now, when I can find a way up. Uh, nope. We want the quest book. There we go. And we'll come out of this quickly. Uh, come out of this. Go into here. That should be that quest complete. Fantastic. Now we have to craft 120 grout. That's easy enough to do. Uh, so, gravel. Sand and clay, 64, 64, that's 120 grout, okay, that quest should be done now hopefully, yes it is, and we will claim reward, fantastic, and we've got 64 coal for it as well, that's good, and now we will go back to base it a bit and build our smeltery, and we will get 5 lava buckets, that is fantastic. Um, yeah, and then I can go find out if that is actually oil next to us. Okay, so let's head back, because yet again I haven't marked our uh, base on the map. Um, so yeah, I will do a bit of... Uh, uh, what am I going to do? Cool, guys, I'm having a memory block here. I've just said it literally and I've already forgotten. Yes, I'll go collect some mats off of uh, camera. Uh, as it's probably one of the most boring things to watch. Uh, and to be fair, it's not the greatest thing to do on camera either. 
especially to keep you guys like entertained throughout. Not really one for talking, as you've probably noticed. Um, but yeah, we'll get through that. We'll get some mats, and we'll probably call it there. And then I'll start recording again. But for now, I'll carry on this episode, and uh, I'll start with the smeltery stuff. Is that some tin? I don't think that's tin. Ooh, there's a cave there, though. I'll tell you what, guys. Let's go on a bit of an investigation. See what we can find. Get the pickaxe out. Is this tin? No, it's salt. We will collect some more um, coal because we're probably going to use a lot of coal. There we go. So I saw some more somewhere else. There it is. There we go. I'm sure we just broke that. There we go. Bit of lag. Never mind. Uh, that's copper. Well, we might as well get it while we're here. Not really what we're looking for, but... Ugh, underwater mining. Most painful thing in the world. There we go. Cool. Okay, let's find our way out. Aha, uh -huh, here we go. Alright, we're out. Not what he's looking for, really. But, it's mats at the end of the day. Some more coal there. Some more copper. Just get that. There we go. Coal. I believe at some point also we have to build a coal generator. Which is my reason for collecting a lot of coal. Because that thing burns through coal like there's no tomorrow. There we go. Uh, dig our way out. Grab this coal on the way out. Get through that block. Go, what's this? Marble! I didn't know marble was in this mod pack. I might try and find some marble to build our uh, base out of because I'm very much like marble. It's quite a nice uh, texture. Um, right, we live somewhere over here, don't we? Lots of pigs. A beach. Some squids. A tree. Cows. More cows. Oh, how I hate cows at the moment. Let's just pick this up. Oh, this is actually iron. We need this. I thought it was copper. That's good. So it should be... Oh, nearly. That's 13 now. So we need two more iron and 10 tin. Who would have thought tin would have been the hardest thing to find, eh? I normally struggle for iron. Okay. Let's just get back. Base should be over here somewhere. I think. No, it's this way. It's this way. Ooh, that doesn't look good. Um. That way. Nearly there. There's the pumpkins. Ooh. Oh, that wasn't a bigger drop as I thought it was going to be. In fact, I don't think I dropped at all. The mysterious liquid. Okay. And we're back. Alright. Okay. So. Quest. Was. To make 120 seared bricks. It's nice and easy. Have that in. Right guys, it's taken two Minecraft days, but we finally got our seared bricks. Uh, while it was uh, 
while I was standing around waiting for these to go, I also went out and collected the seeds we needed for the uh, quests in getting started and also collect some wood just because wood's always handy to have. Right, so seeds. Uh, we need now need to craft a mattock. That's fine, we'll make a stone one in a minute. Um, it's getting dark, let's have a quick nap. So yeah, I decided to cut all that out because standing there watching the bricks be built is just absolutely boring. I mean, I walked away just to get it done. Um, right, so let's go and have a look at the tinker section, as I'm going to call it. Tools and weapons. Open. Building as much as we've done that. Okay, we've got to craft a smart controller, casting table, seared brick, a seared tank, sorry, uh, a seared faucet, and a smeltery drain. Right, that's easy enough. Okay. Craft. So, we want... Casting table. Ah, now this is why I made extra glass. Because we need some glass for the tank. So, bush. Okay, that's that done. Cool, alright, then we need... Come out of this. Crafting table. We need... A smeltery drain, which is this. Like so. A faucet. Uh, what else was there? A smeltery controller. Like so. And we will need to craft a bit of glass. The fact that's using tinkers before, you know what you're making. Put the glass in. Grab the seared brick. Put it around. And one seared tank. Is that everything? Let's have a look. Yes. There we go. Look at that. And now we need to craft 22 seared bricks. Should be easy enough to do. Um, let's go. Split, 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 split. That's 16. So we need six more. So one, two, three, four, five, six. 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 Fantastic. That is our 22 seed bricks. Uh, I'm going to put. I'm going to make small grout quickly, guys. Because I want to be able to have another two smeltery drains and have two casting basins, which basically makes blocks of iron, gold and such. And I'm not quite sure why it's never put in in this, but I prefer it. Let's uh, not do that, actually. Let's do half. We won't need that much. Here we go. So that's number 62. Oh, go on, screw it. We'll make another two on top of that. That's 64. So that'll be another 64 bricks. Put them in the oven. So, okay, now we've done that, what we've got to do, cut your ward, get a fight, ooh, I don't think our inventory is going to be able to take that, nope, that's empty out, yeah, seeds, I may have to make another uh, chest the way this is going, um, chuck that in there, chuck that in there, chuck that in there, the wood can go in there for now. Uh, that can go in there. And we won't need that for the quest, so that can go in there for now. Yeah, that should do. Okay. Okay, let's complete the quest then. Okay, guys, five buckets of lava. Okay, come out. Next quest. We've got to craft a tool forge. Which is where we need blocks of stuff, so that's going to take a while. I won't be able to do that just yet, guys. But for now, I think I will put my smeltery about hmm, out of the way, but not too out of the way. Let's put it behind the stuff, shall we? So, dig a hole. One, two, three. Oh, we didn't want to break that block. Put that back in. Uh, move the lava bucket. It does annoy me that buckets don't stack, but then again, at the same time, it does kind of make mistake. So, one, two, three, one, two, two, three. There we go. Now we grab the seared bricks. Uh, let's move that lava bucket for now. 
Okay, so now we want to fill this in, like so, to make the base of the smell tree. There we go. Now what I tend to do is I tend to build a level up first on the outside before I put the smell tree drains and stuff in. So, like so. Which is not what the mod pack wants, so it means that's why I'm building the extra bricks. Okay, there we go. Now then, we need to put in a uh, smell controller. I think we shall put the smell tree controller here, so I can see it no matter where I am. Uh, this is a smell tree drain, so we shall put this this side out of the way. That's a seared brick. We'll just chuck that up here for now. Um, right, so seared tank. Uh, again, for easy access, we'll put it here. And then we need the casting basin. Which will go below the uh, so not basin car uh, a casting table, which goes there, and the faucet will go there. There we go, sorted. And while we're here, let's just get rid of a few of these lava buckets. Like so to fill it up. Now it won't work properly just yet, as I haven't finished building it yet. Uh, is that done? Um, there we go. One full tank of lava. Fantastic. And we've still got a bucket spare. That's good. Right. Okay, guys. What's in the quest book? Oh, no, that's the stencil. Oh, we going to craft a mattock, wasn't we? Right, so let's go to the stencil table. And uh, we need a mattock head, which is that one, I believe. Scythe head. Same thing. That's what they use for the mattock. Pull that out. Shove that in there. Uh, right, we'll go to the fort tool station first and see how we craft a mattock. We need a shovel head. Oh, apparently I was wrong. That was a scythe head. So we need the axe head, a shovel head, and a tool rod. It's easy enough to do. Okay, cool. We will steal some of this cobblestone out of here. Okay, so. Shovel head. Done. And an axe head. Done. And then we need a tool rod. Done. Fantastic. Put that there. Put that back in there. Over to here. Okay. So, take this out for a minute. And we go to Matuk. Put in the bits, and we will call this mm, farming stick. I think. Yes, terrible naming. I know, but I think it's funny. So there you go, and there we go. One mattock. Okay, quest log. Okay, uh, getting started. That was in this one, wasn't it? We've got to craft 10 pieces of bread, so it means we're going to have to start making our farm. So I think I'll save that for next time, guys. Um, yeah, hope you've enjoyed it, and until next time, guys, see you later.